<laughs> I love Story Club. <laughs> Me too. Let's race. For this week's story club? Yep, we're here to hear. <laughs> <laughs> here you read from one of the great books. <laughs> what is it gonna be today? Well now, let's see. Follow me up to the story loft. Oh, the story loft! Okay now, are you ready? Come on everybody, lend your little ears. Gather round, gather round, I promise you my dears. It's the most amazing story you're ever gonna hear. The most amazing story we're ever gonna hear. Wow, the colors! Whoa, wow, the sparkles! Wow! They're beautiful! It says, two for the sky. Oh, one of my favorites. A wonderful story about two ponies who are so much alike, they're almost twins. Really? Two ponies like twins? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I can't wait. Oh, twins. Yes, just like twins. And you'll never believe what happens to them. Now, where is that book? Ah, Gossamer. <clears throat> Gossamer? Gossamer, I would just love it if you would get me the storybook. Two for the sky. You'll find it under T for two. Upon a pony, there were two friends named Starflight and Heartbreath. Two ponies who were so close, they were almost like twins. They hopscotched together, they shared Sundays together. Yes, Starflight and Heartbright were as close as any two pony friends could be. And one day, at the very same time, in the very same way, <laughs> they both wished they had wings so they could fly above the clouds. At first, they watched how others fly. Simple as a dimple. <laughs> what you doing, Star Flight and Heart Bright? We're wishing and hoping we could take flight. Silly, we're ponies, and ponies don't fly. I know, but haven't you ever wanted to try? Bees 
wings just might do. Lead on, my friend. After you. Starflight and Heartbright try and try again to fly. No matter what they did, they couldn't get off the ground. So they stayed up all night building wings and things. Are you steady? Utterly, I'm so ready. So as soon as they could, Starflight and Heartbright traveled to Breezy Blossom to learn how to fly. 